Okay, we are in our phonemic awareness training for day seven. We are starting with rhyme repetition. So I'm going to say the rhyme, and then your child is going to repeat that rhyme after me. Fine line. So your child would say fine line. So repeat after me with every rhyme. Late date. Ape cape. Fish dish. Lunch brunch. Cute flute. Wide slide. Real meal. School tool. Boat float. Now we are moving on to onset fluency. So I'm going to say the word and the students would repeat the word and isolate the onset, which is the beginning sound. Here's my word. Name. So your child would say name. N. Mm. Pig. Pig. P. Quit. Quit. Qu. Rain. Rain. Er. C. C. S. Talk. Talk. Voice, voice, v. water, water, w. zero, zero, z, you, you, y. Now we are going to blend our words together. So I'm going to say the word with a pause in between them and then students will repeat the words with a pause and then say the compound word together. So here's our first one. After noon. So your child would say after noon, afternoon. Base ball. Baseball. I lid. Eyelid. Night time. Nighttime. Airport. Airport. Overnight. Overnight. Bed spread. Bed spread. Class room. Classroom. School work. School work. Grandma. Grandma. Now we are doing the final sounds in words. So I'm going to say the word. Students would repeat the word and then identify the final sound in that word. So here's my first one. Kiss. So since the last sound in kiss is s, the students would say kiss, s. Let's try it with the next one. Hat. Drive. V. Prize. Prize. Z. Web. B. Lid. D. Roof. F. Leg. G. Large. J. Cook. K. Now we are going to segment our words. So I'm going to say the compound word and then students will repeat the word and segment it into two words. Here's my first one, football. So students would say football, football. Doghouse. Dog house. Grandpa. Grand paw. Skateboard. Skateboard. Wallpaper. Wallpaper. Handshake. Handshake. 
sometime, some time, raincoat, rain coat, fireworks, fireworks, hideout, hide out. Okay, now we're going to do our last one, which is substituting words. And I'm going to say the word and students would repeat the word and I'm going to say change a word to another word and the word is. So let's do our first example real quick. We have birthday. Now keep in mind, we're starting to substitute the first part in the word since that's the part that is underlined. Okay, so we have birthday, change birth to sun and the word is Sunday. Here's our next word. Sunday. Change sun to every and the word is every day. Every day. Change every to some and the word is someday. Someday. Change some to week and the word is weekday. Weekday. Change week to birth and the word is birthday. Good job, everybody. If you would like to slow down and have your child write the words for you or spell them out for you, that works for me as well. You can do this however you would like. Okay, it's time for our sight words. Boys and girls, let's go over the sight words that we already know. I, say them with me. I. It. It, a, a oops, at, at is. is. Okay, let's do it one more time. I, I it, it a, a, at, is. is. Very good. All right, we have two new sight words. Our sight words today, for this week, are going to be can, and let's say that together can, can and. and all right now what I want you to do is I want to give you a magazine and you're going to look for the words can or and and if you find them you're going to highlight them or circle them so you can just briefly scan Oh, look, we found one already. This is our word, and. So we're going to highlight it. And you'll keep looking and see if you find and or can again. Oh, there we go. What's that word? And. Good. What's that word? And. Very good. And it's okay if we don't find the word can. We can go to another page and look for it somewhere else if we need to. But we'll look a little bit longer. Oh, there's that word again. Our new sight word. What is it? And. Very good. Okay. So you can do this also if you don't have a magazine. If you have a newspaper or an old book, or just, um, you can write um, some sentences on a paper and then let your child find the word and or can, which would be our new sight words, and circle them.